anymore. Now, these are the safety equipments we need. A helmet, some gloves, these arm things, I don't know what they're called. And there are also, these arm things there are also for the, the legs, but because it's not kind of comfortable. So I'm just not gonna wear them, but you guys, you need to wear them because you get hurt. But it's not comfortable for me to ride on the hoverboard. So let's get on to showing the hoverboard. So this is my hoverboard. So now I'm gonna teach you how to switch it on. Otherwise, of course, you can't buy it. So first, you need to like turn it backwards and you see this little button over here. You just press it and it switches on. Now, you may be wondering what this is. Well, that is the battery. Whatever this is glowing red means you need to charge it. That's the wire you need. Is the wire you need to charge it with. You may be wondering what this little like, like oval thing is. Well, if it's red means it is still charging. But if it's green means it's done charging. And you can know if this is charging or not. If it this is also glowing yellow and blinking whenever you're on it. Now let's get on to the riding and now let's get on to the right. You need to keep your knee at the core, like here and here, like this. Then when these are glowing, means you are balancing. You fly and move forward. Yeah. And if you wanna gain speed, just you need to practice a little. You need to practice. And then you can gain speed. See? It's so easy to gain speed and you can reduce speed. You need to like stop for a bit and then come at the speed you are again. That's so easy. You just stop for like a second and then come. You go slow again. You go fast, you stop again, you go slow. It's so easy. But you can only go slow if you stop for a second and go slow if you want.